Well, sculptures will once again be switched out in downtown Bemidji. It's all for the city's annual sculpture walk, an event that's organized by a local board of directors. Jackson Bruner visited the setup as it began tonight. The art comes to Minnesota from all over the Midwest. I think the variety is what makes it interesting, and everybody gets a chance to find stuff they like, stuff they don't like, but it always generates conversation. From now through Saturday, the board is busy replacing about 20 statues all around downtown Bemidji. Bemidji is an art town. It's an art mecca, and, and this is just one of the examples of art being on display along with our murals. In a new development for this year, the event is expanding to include a more national audience with at least one piece coming from Rhode Island. As usual, everyone will be compensated for their work. Every artist gets paid $300 honorarium per piece. Some artists will include two pieces and they'll get $500. Once setup is complete, maps will be available in Bemidji's Tourist Information Center so people can hunt for every new piece of art. This is just another way to enhance your downtown. People stop in, they see Paul and Babe, and they go, hey, there's some other stuff down the road here. Let's go downtown Bemidji and see the other sculptures. In Bemidji, Jackson Bruner, Lakeland News. A $1,000 People's Choice Award will be awarded after an online poll finishes. There will also be first, second place Critics' Choice winners as well. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.